Well, I'm in London this week and I've got lots and lots of things to do. It's not often I get a week to get everything done. So, busy week. I've got to finish up a coaching app. Uh, I've got to do some stuff for CNN. And to top it off, I'm going to head to Norway. And I'm going to have some fun with my granddaughter. And daughter, of course. I'm in London. I'm heading into CNN Studios uh, here in London to finish up the coaching app, coaching tip app. There's a hell of a lot of work to do, but somehow we're going to get it done. So here we are in the CNN Studios and long-suffering Harvey here. Poor Harvey. Hello, mate. Hello. There he is, poor guy. He's not allowed to leave here for about three days until <laughs> it's done. He's actually got a bed down here somewhere, sleeping. That's under there. All right, okay. <laughs> Day three in the studio. How's it going, Alf? Good, good, good. Different, different edit suite. Same tennis. Same tennis. It's been here forever. Come on, give a bit of a preview. Here we go. What have we got? Anyone want to critique this serve? There we go. A little bit of the slow motion stuff we're going to put in here. There we go. I put him in the shed, right? Yeah, okay. yeah. One of the perks or not so perks of the job. I don't really like getting my photo taken, but <laughs> I'm do a few Austin Powers moves here. Here we've got Michaela. Superstar right here. She's a, she's a superstar and the lovely Michelle, mum, mum's over there. <laughs> and we've got Heidi, we've got the scene in crew. So we thought we'd, <laughs> we thought we'd grab them for a little yeah. interview. Hope you didn't mind, yeah. guys. Let's go. And I'm gonna let's vlog. And, and, a, uh, and a hit on the court? Yeah, yeah. yeah let's go. Oh, yeah, let's go. Forget the interview, let's go for a hit. <laughs> <laughs> well, here we go, you got a chance to play with the Bryan brothers on the, on the court here. Unfortunately, we've got CNN cameras everywhere, so I can't relax and tell dirty jokes. Well, I'm in Oslo at the moment, and when I arrive, this is one of the first things I do, is I get one of these hot dogs. Now, I'm not a big hot dog fan, but I am here in Norway. These are great. There's the pancakes, these little pancake things. They've got the dried and, and, and uh, fresh onions and strong mustard. It's fantastic. Who's the birthday girl? Who's, who's the birthday is it today? Me! It, no, it's me! 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 Let's make the cake. Where's the cake? Oh, there's a, here's a cake. This one. Mm. Oh, this one here. Ah, oh, there too. Mm. Oh, there is a cake. Birthday cake. Mama, I made this for my cocoa too. You want to put these on your cake? Your grandpa yeah. is going to help make this put to perfection. <laughs> Well, I was here about 12 hours ago, uh, coming back from Oslo, Heathrow Terminal 5. This time, instead of playing with a little three-year-old, I'm going to be tackling Nicolas Almagro in Madrid. His forehand's got nothing on mine. Well, this is the first time I've been to the Madrid Open in um, Madrid. Uh, and it looks like a, I don't know, uh, it's like a hotel complex or conference center or something. Certainly doesn't look like a tennis center. Very modern. Let's go in and have a look. Huh? Well, I've made it on court here um, in Madrid. And look, look who I've got. I'm about to interview. Nick hey, how are you? Magro. Everything fine? You going to uh, show me some forehands, proper forehands? Yeah, I would try. Okay. I would try. We'll see if, <laughs> if I can hit you or not. <laughs> I think you probably hit me. Oh, I'll, be, I'll get my armor. I'll get okay, myself ready. Three rackets. I'll three rackets? Ready. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Well, all these people have turned up to watch. It looks like it doesn't. You can't really tell the people up there, but they they are, and they've come over here to watch. He may be Spanish number three, but he's number twelve in the world. Only in Spain could you be number twelve in the world and be the third third country person in your country. But uh, I need to warm up. There we go. They're all chanting. They're all screaming out to him. I'm in big trouble here. Comes the serve. Oh, needs balls.
Well, for my sins, sometimes I have to do corporate tennis events and oh, look at the mugs yeah. that I have to put up with. Say hello, everybody! Hey. 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 You know what? These guys are the best gang I've ever had. <laughs> here we go. I got the lovely Annabelle Croft here. <laughs> And then there's the winner, Michael. So, and we got Lee. Lee Childs is over there as well. So we've just had a bit of a fun tennis day, and uh, with a team from B and P Paribas. Yeah, we yeah, really had, had fun, didn't we? We've had a lot of fun. We had a lot of fun. <laughs> Always. Got some sore shoulders after this day. Well, Lee, Lee was just serving about 300 miles. I, you got to I should have videoed some of the guys <laughs> darting out right of the way. Oh, no. oh, the joys of travelling. Taking out here at Eurostar, every single thing, right in front of everybody, looking for God knows what. Well, a pretty good spot to be doing a little few links for the, for the show. I'm standing on top of sort of this platform here, and uh, lots of people spectating. There were lots of people watching, but I sort of started messing my lines up. Like I kind of bored with it, and all left. No. Well, just finishing up the show uh, at Roland Garros here at the Centre Court, Court Philippe Chatrier. And uh, it's not quite prepared yet, the, the Centre Court, as you can see, the posters and stands and all that sort of stuff up. But a couple of weeks will be pretty busy.